Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're covering an updated tutorial on how to set up the iPhone link feature inside of Windows 11. If you're a frequent PC user and maybe you do a lot of your work from your computer, the iPhone link feature will allow you to use the Windows interface to keep up with all of your text and call notifications on your phone. It's a pretty cool feature and can help make your workflow a little bit more seamless depending on how you like to be productive depending on your workflow. Before we jump into this tutorial, if you're interested in purchasing Windows 11, Windows 10, Microsoft Office, remote desktop licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. So without further ado, let's jump in. All right, guys, so we're on my desktop here inside of Windows 11. And I have my phone nearby because we are going to need to access that here in just a minute. It's important to make sure that our Windows software is fully up to date. And I have recently checked mine. So with that, let's go ahead and open up iPhone link. It's going to automatically be installed with your system on the latest update of Windows 11. Now, the very first thing we're prompted for here is to choose a device to get started. Again, I'm on iPhone here, so I'll click on iPhone. Next, I'm going to take my phone here. And based on the prompt of the screen, we're going to take this and open the camera app. And I'm simply just going to scan the QR code that's on the screen here. All right, guys. So here on my phone, I'm simply going to click this open button. And again, this is going to open up a prompt. It's going to ask us to continue pairing with Bluetooth. I'll press continue. From here, we can press allow. And here we're prompted with a code. So again, it says my computer name would like to pair with iPhone. On my computer, as we can see on the screen recording, the code matches what is on my phone, so I'll hit pair. You can see it says connecting, so I'm just gonna let this load for now. All right, so back on the computer here, we have a little confirmation page, and we can either leave this checked or unchecked, depending on whether we want this to automatically open our iPhone link when we sign in. If you plan on using it on a regular basis, I think it's fine to leave this checked, which I will, so we'll press get started. All right, and then we have a little tab up at the top here for messages, we have one for calls. We can also click this to view our message pane, and we also have other notifications that would pop up on our Instagram. At this point, again, we can use Windows as our hub to maybe quickly answer some texts or even take calls from your PC without having to manually grab and access your phone. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. If you have any questions about the iPhone link feature or how to get that set up, please drop those in the comments below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Again, if you're interested in purchasing genuine Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll put links down below. As our channel grows, we're constantly looking for new video topic ideas to make. If you guys have any topics that you would like to see, please comment those below as most of our requests get made into actual videos. Lastly, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated as it helps to support the channel. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you guys next time.